Welcome. I'm Ted Weisberg, and I want to welcome you to the New York Four, the New York Stock Exchange, and I'm going to take you on a tour of the exchange. We're in what we call the main room, and you need to look at this beautiful ceiling because this is a, uh, this is a spectacular room that has been here as long as the exchange has been here, which is well over 100 years. The specialists are at the kiosks that we see around us, trading different stocks, and the brokers communicating with their clients are lined all around, or are lined all around the room. So now what I do as a broker, my, my responsibility is to represent my clients on the trading floor. I guess I should bid 95, right? Buying the stock as cheaply as I can or selling it as dearly as I can. And I call the client the dog. The dog can live in London. The dog can live in San Francisco. The dog is the decision maker. All I'm doing is imp implementing that process. So uh, we just got an order. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to enter this order, trades right here electronically, and then we'll go over and see what the stock looks like. See, we're going to go to where this particular stock trades. So it trades at post four section S. So we walk around post four. This is all Goldman Sachs, Spear Leads. They're the dealers in all these stocks. The stock is the GGP. GGP, can you tell me how GGP is? Thirty thousand offered at twenty-one cents right now. Right. Let's give you a name up now. Thank you very much. A broker, of course, has his orders, but he's always looking up to get a sense of what the market is doing, reading the headlines, looking at what oil's doing, look at what gold is doing, looking at what the Dow is doing, looking at the currencies, and I guess if he needs to know, looking at what time it is around the world. Well. When I come to work every day, this is exactly where I come. This is Seaport Security's location on the trading floor. Uh, my clerk, uh, Lewis, is uh, here. And uh, uh, Lewis, come say hello. Hi. And uh, we, we actually are on the trading floor about 8 or 8.15 every morning. Lewis is here. And uh, I think a lot of money changes hands, a lot of money. Is it gambling? I guess it's all in the eyes of the beholder. Uh, certainly there is a, a, a huge risk element to it, so if there's risk, I guess it's fair to say it is a form of gambling. I don't choose to see it that way. If I want to gamble, I go to Las Vegas. And now, to continue our tour, this is the podium where they ring the bell, and at 4 o'clock they ring a bell, and trading ends. Somebody presses a button, the, the, bu the bell goes off, a hammer down, like at the docket, and it's over. And it happens at exactly four o'clock every day and it's never changed. And luckily in these bad markets, I'm glad it's over at four o'clock because if by four o'clock you've had enough, you just want to go home.